everyone so it's back to school season and even if you're not going back to school this year I still feel like we can all feel it in the air we walk into a store and there are the back to school sales going on and all that type of stuff and I was talking to my sister and my friends about it and we all kind of feel the same way the beginning of the year January is when the new year is starting and you make your resolutions and all that type of stuff but for us growing up you know we spent so long of the time thinking that the year was like starting when back to school started so it's just kind of like to us a time where you get yourself organized and maybe you do something that you've been putting off for the past couple months because it was like summertime and everybody was happy and cheery and like gonna put things off because they just wanted to have fun and stuff like that so I feel like this is a time just to get organized get your life organized do things that you've put off so I decided that I was going to finally complete my room you guys know that I've been redecorating my room for quite some time now and there were a few little accent pieces that I still needed I knew that I wanted to get like a rug and I I knew that I needed a couple more like organization bins and stuff so I decided to go ahead and get that stuff from pbteen.com and I wanted to show you guys how I've organized my room but make sure you stay tuned until the end of the video because I will let you know how you could win a four thousand dollar PBT gift certificate so it's pretty awesome I'll tell you guys all about that after I show you what I have in my room what's new what I've used to organize I know you can probably tell but I have some new bedding that I absolutely love um, so I will go ahead and show you guys that and then I will be back to tell you all about the contest. So when you're standing looking at my bed, this is kind of what you see. And I think right off the bat, the first thing that you'll be able to tell that is different is this crinkle puff quilt at the bottom of the bed right here that I have folded over. It just keeps me extra warm at night. Hi, teddy bear. Teddy loves sleeping on it. And then I also have the shams. I thought it just kind of made everything on my bed look a little bit um, just like more clean and streamlined when I had the solid color instead of the shams that I used to have that were like patterned as well. I thought it was a little bit too much. And then you guys can see over here that I have these boxes. I have one that says magazines on it. And then I have two miscellaneous ones over here. And this just really helps me with organization and I love that. And then over here, what you doing Teddy? What you doing? He's like, I don't know mom. What are you doing? Yeah. Okay, and then over here I have these two pink chairs that are from pbteen.com and I got these a while ago. But I added this area rug below it and it just kind of cuts off this part of my bedroom and makes it seem like this is like my little hangout area. So when I make my bed in the morning and then I want to just chill, get on my computer, something like that, I'll actually just sit in these two chairs because I find that's a lot easier than unmaking my bed, climbing back in, making it again, things like that. So that is this little area and the thing that I have changed around here. So now you guys can see I have more of the dotty storage bins underneath my bed. I have one for bathing suits and I have one for leggings, but these are great just to hold the items that you may not need to use every other day, but you don't want them to take up a bunch of space in your dresser or something like that. Over here next to Teddy's dog bed, I actually have one of the medium sized boxes and it just holds a bunch of his toys and he will actually get up on his bed and jump into the box to find whatever type of toy or bone he wants and then bring it back out and then every day I throw them all back in there and he loves it and I put a little label that says Teddy's toys on it so it's nice that you're really able to organize everything and I could put the lid on it if I wanted it to look not as cluttered so I like that I'm not sure if you guys remember back when I had those big black bins in my closet but now I'm actually using the dotty storage bins and I just have things like my flat sandals and my dust bags just little things like that my ballet flats that I don't wear every single day but I like to have them available so I just put them in those boxes and they fit on my shelves perfectly so I was like this works out pretty nice so these are really good they can also give your closet a little pop of color which I think is nicer than just having plain bends so this mirror is an over-the-door hanging mirror and it's actually probably one of my favorite ads that I got for my room I didn't have a full-length mirror so now when I try on outfits I don't have to go to Elle's room to look at her full-length mirror I can just look at mine it was super easy to assemble I actually did it myself I hung it over the door and then I like that it has a cork board on the side and it comes with little pins so I just put a little note that said you are beautiful but I think it's gonna be fun when I have friends over they 
they can write little notes, you can write any reminders, you can write inspirational quotes or even just pin up some pictures of yourself with friends. I thought that that was really cool. So I love that. And then when you go into the bathroom. So the last thing I wanted to show you guys were my new bathroom accessories. You guys know I like to have my soap dispenser and my Q-tip and cotton swab holder and stuff. So I got these to match all the other things. And it's just these little things that tie the entire room together and I think it makes a huge difference. I have the matching washcloth and the tissue box right over here. The last thing I have is this makeup mirror and one side is um, a magnifying side and then the other side is just regular. I use it to tweeze my brows or when I'm, I'm applying my makeup and I love the detail on it. I think it's a lot prettier than just those makeup mirrors that are plain silver and I feel like this detail just adds a little bit of femininity to my bathroom, if that makes any sense. I'm not even sure if that's a word. I think these little accessories that tie your entire room together is what makes a room look complete and decorated instead of just kind of thrown together. So I love these, these little bathroom accessories. So I'm sure you guys want to know what you need to do to win that $4,000 PBT and gift certificate. So you are going to need to film and submit a video about what your hopes and goals are that you want to achieve this coming year. It could be school related or it could be just completely like a life goal for yourself. It could be academics or extracurricular. You're just going to need to film a video and submit it and you could be entered to win a $4,000 PBT and gift card, which is is incredibly amazing. I can't even begin to imagine, like you would have an entirely new bedroom for back to school. But even if you're not gonna, you know, completely redo your bedroom, just a couple little accent pieces are going to make you feel like it's a new space. You could rearrange your furniture to make it feel like a new room when you're walking in, or you could get different curtains, or add an accent piece, a chair, or you could just switch out your bedding in a color theme that kind of already goes with the rest of your stuff in the room. Anything like that is just going to make you feel like you have an updated space, and I almost feel like, you know, your bedroom is like your own personal style. At the end of the day, that is what's youer than you. You can tell a lot by the person about the way they've decorated their room and the way they keep their room and if they're very organized or if they're, you know, kind of just like messy. And I think we've all gone through phases where we're both of those. Most people do. But also just like colors and patterns and textures that you can mix together and just create an ambiance. And I feel like when you walk into your room, you need to feel happy. You need to feel excited. You need to feel like you are home because at the end of the day, that's your room. I've personally been obsessed with PBT for actually longer than I could remember. My mom used to decorate my room using Pottery Barn Kids. Um, and then I moved into PBT. And I think that it's just, you know, they have really unique and innovative designs. And I think that when you just go on their site, everything is kind of like a casual classic preppy look, but there are lots of like modern pieces that you can have and stuff like that. So I think they have a bit of a design that would go with everybody's like aesthetic of what they wanted their room to look like. And they also have some really great pieces that if you don't want to redo your entire room, you can just add this, like even adding an area rug or um, like new curtains or something like that, that can give your room such a different feel, a new throw pillow on your bed, any of that type of stuff is just like awesome. Don't forget to submit your video to enter the PBT contest to win a $4,000 gift card and you can vote on the entries because that is going to help determine the winner, which is awesome because we kind of have a hand in who is going to win the $4,000 gift card, which is incredible. Like I can't even wrap my mind around what a cool space that you would have and you would be able to call it yours. So, you know, let us know what your ho hopes and your goals and your, you know, your wishes that you want to achieve this year are and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.